check out with you guys, check in with you guys in just a second. I want to talk to Myth right now. Let's bring him in. Uh, the uh, the literal cheerleader. Uh, I'm not. He's he had the outfit on at least from what I saw yesterday. Myth, are you are you there? Yeah, it's me. I'm gonna, take that as a, I'm gonna take that as a soft <laughs> no. So uh, Hello? I, <laughs> I hear so, him. Oh, I hear him. I heard him. I heard him. Do, are we audio Hello? only here? Second voice of God. My camera's I guess on. We're going audio only for Myth. I, I got Myth. you, Myth. Okay. What up, buddy? <laughs> Oh, How you good. doing? I'm glad to have you. I'm not sure. I'm not sure if we had the audio available, but I guess we'll keep Simon Van still here with us. So, Myth, I know you've been you've been rocking the you've been rocking the uh, the co stream. I appreciate uh -huh. the support. How does it feel to see your boys take this victory? Well, it feels great as Coach Myth. You know, coming into this round, we were kind of you know it was a one to one situation, so we felt you know we're our backs were against the wall. But I got the boys in the locker room right before that match started. I say, you know what? We're gonna give it everything we got. We're gonna get everything okay. we got. Hunter, they did. You know the pastors are saying, oh, okay, "T1's we got gonna take it. T1's <laughs> gonna take it." But no, I told my boys we have exactly what it takes, and we took it, baby. So I'm talking I'm, about I'm baby. Did you see some Rosa? How many points did he put on the board? <laughs> I'm gonna actually step out of points? this interview and just let you rant for a while. Uh, so is, is this this is the coach's outfit I see? Now, did you actually do any research? What is in the notebook? And did you write down the entire Any Given Sunday monologue from Al Pacino? Is that available? No, that's not available. Well, let me tell you what is. <laughs> right? The detailed plan of this entire series. Do you think that we just gave up a map unintentionally with a comeback like that? No, that's psychological gameplay, baby. That's, that's some next generational stuff that you've never seen before from this young and bright talent. Okay, so tell me what has been the standout for you from what you see now. I know you're a high level player. You're out there. You're you're grinding. What have you been seeing from this team, this TSM roster that has been impressing you the most? Well, let me tell you. All the players on the field got exactly, you know, they got what it takes. It's top tier play out there, baby. But at the end of the day, these boys got the gusto. Right, they got exactly, they got the personalities that just merge and flow together. So if you think it's about gameplay, it ain't baby. Well, it is, but it ain't. Cause they got <laughs> the next step, right? They got the next level. And that is the personality to dominate the competition. And that's why, you know, I decided to jump up on it, guess coach and, and you know, take them where they need to go. So talk about your team building exercises, Coach Myth. I really want to know, what are you doing to keep these guys close, personal, together, gelling as a team? Y'all are really milking this coach thing, huh? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Listen, you brought the jacket, I'm bringing you with it, okay? If you're going to bring the props, I'm bringing the questions. <laughs> okay, so you know what we're doing with them, boys? I mean, every time we win, we're going to Dairy Queen. Right after, me and the boys, <laughs> of course, six feet distance. Then it's Chuck E. Cheese pizzas all night long. Going down the swirly slide, baby. All night. Woo! Okay, Come I like on. it. So let's say let's say we have a 1v1 situation. We got Sabrosa, we got Wardell. They're in the ball pit. It's for all the tickets. They're going to bring the big, the big stuffed animal down for the winner. Who are you taking? Who are you backing? I'm going to have to pick Wardell. If you've seen that man, he is very chunky, right? Short height. He could okay. go in and out of the ball pit at a very accelerated rate. And that is what you need when you're in the ball pit. Let me tell you, I've been in the ball pit a few times. Okay, excellent. I, I, I don't want to ask about any ball pit war stories, especially live on broadcast. Uh, but yeah. I want to hear a prediction. I'm going to give you a nice, uh, you know, you, you jumped in. You jumped in. And I appreciate that. Mm -hmm. It's going to be a nice, easy question for you. Uh, who do you think on TSM is the cutest of all of all the players? Oh boy! On the TSM Valorant team? Yeah, I had to. Obviously, we know the real answer if we open it up to all of TSM. But let's just focus on the Valorant team. Uh, okay. <laughs> um, I think I'm gonna have to give it. My God, the Golly OG Cutler's bald head. <laughs> Oh my God, I can spit shine that thing so shiny. Oh, especially after that play last game. Oh my God. It's got to, it's going to Cutler. I love that man. I got to disagree. I got to disagree with you there. Uh -huh. Clearly oh, hazed with that, with that full head of hair. He's got that, he's got the Joel uh -huh. Last of Us look, you know, he's, he's grizzled. He's got the, he's got the beard. It's really full. You know, uh -huh. I, I, I really, I really have to respect people with hair just in general. So, I mean, that's my prerogative. 
So I'm going to have to, you know, I, I think at this point, we're going to have to say, you know, myth, we're going to agree to disagree. We're going to let you go. That's fine. I appreciate you stepping in. And uh, I, I, again, appreciate it. One man to the next, uh, or one man to another, I should say. Thank you for the support. I want to see that skirt plus the suit jacket next time. Don't sleep on it, okay? I'm a fashion expert. All right, that's a combination that I got to think of strategically in the playbook, <laughs> but we'll, hey, thank you for having me on. Uh, see you okay. guys all later. <laughs> TSM, go! Woo! Okay, man, thank you so much. What, what else can you say, really? I don't, I don't, I, uh... I don't think I, I don't think either of us were ready for that interview for real. No. But uh, I love that man. <laughs> shout out to love man. That, man. Step stepping I, in. Yeah, I love it. I I honestly like most times I feel like I have an interview in hand. That time I did not. I did not feel like 